Can you remember the last time you wrote a switch statement in PHP? I can't, because honestly, switch sucked and I never really wanted to use it. It had this clunky syntax, it was pretty limited, and I'd rather use if else if statements than switch. But then, then came along PHP 8 and it gave us match. See, Match has a couple of advantages compared to Switch. First, you have to write less code, which is a good thing. Because, let's be real, who likes to write code? Besides it being shorter, it also returns a value. Which is a pretty big deal, because with Switch, we had to assign variables in every case, leading to quite a bit of duplication, but you also couldn't return the result of the Switch directly. You had to create a temporary variable and return that one. So with Match, all those problems are gone, but it gets even better. Match doesn't use type coercion, or in simple terms, it's using the triple equal sign instead of the double equal sign, so it's more strict. That means no type juggling, which leads to less subtle bugs in your code. Match will throw an error when it gets a value that isn't handled. You can have an optional default branch if you want to catch these edge cases, but you don't need to. Again, leading to less subtle bugs. Also, there's no more break keyword, no weird fall-through conditions like we had to be careful of when using switch. And what's seriously cool is that match can't just handle simple values. No, no, no. It can match function calls, enums and arrays. Take this, for example. You can match arrays with multiple values. You can match on true and call functions. The first to return true will be the matched arm. And enums combined with match are a match made in heaven. Okay, all of that to say is that Match is pretty cool. It is what Switch should have been, and I've been using it all throughout my codebase since PHP 8. 